This is the River Thet. The River Thet runs through East Harling in Norfolk. Um, the River Set, uh, Thet runs from the source to the mouth. The so source of the river has to be in that direction. And we know this because of the flow of the river. If you look down here, you should be able to see the river is flowing in this direction. Rivers always go from the hills in the source to the mouth. So the sea must be somewhere in that direction, probably quite a few miles over there. So all this water has landed as rainfall and it's ran off into this river and that's how it makes its way to the sea. Now what I'm going to talk about is some river processes. There are three main river processes. One is called erosion. That's where the water wears away rocks in the river and the riverbank. The second one is called transportation. This is when, if I pick up a rock here, this is transported or carried along by the river water like this. Now it's not very powerful, the water here, so this will probably just drop to the ground. But actually, that's an example of the third process, which is called deposition. That's when the river drops rocks onto the ground. So if you think almost like a bus, the bus picks people up, so it erodes things, it transports them, carries them along in the water, and then deposits them, which is called deposition, where it drops things on the floor. Now, there are four different types of river erosion, and you need to know all four of them. The first one is called abrasion. This is where a rock, and I've just lost the rock I had a minute ago, I'll get a new one. The river here, the, the rock here, hits the side of the river bank over here and will wear it away. That's abrasion. So it's the rubbing or hitting of rocks against the side of the river. The second type is called attrition. This is when you will have two rocks floating along in the river and they hit each other like that and little bits will break off over time and the rocks become smaller and smaller. The third type is called hydraulic action. Hydraulic action is the power of the water. Over here, if you follow me, the water is quite strong and it's hitting the bank over here harder. The flow is much faster and therefore that power of that water will wear away the bank as it has over there and that will erode it itself. So hydraulic action is the power of the water smashing into the side of the river bank and getting into cracks. Um, and the final one is called solution. Solution is erosion by the acid that's in the river water, which gradually wears away the outsides of rocks. So those are the four types of erosion. Now, there are also four types of river transportation. 